Hey everyone, in this video I wanted to share with you two tips that will help you start building momentum if you feel like your life isn't quite what you want it to be right now. That could be because maybe you're feeling a bit depressed, maybe things aren't happening the way that you desire, or maybe you just wish you were in a different place right now, or it could even be that you're dealing with something a bit traumatic. If things aren't the way that you want them to be right now, it's going to take work to get you out of that place. But there's going to be a problem here. And it's usually the fact that there's going to be anxiety and stress and just a lot of thoughts you'll be having about whatever it is that's bothering you, and that's going to leave you feeling drained. There's literally a physical reason for you feeling like you have no energy. If you're thinking a lot, if you're <laughs> spending a lot of time just being anxious or stressed out because of whatever it is in your life that isn't what you desire, it's literally going to make you lose energy. Like our thoughts, even though we feel like they're separate from us, like they're not related to us physically, our brain spends energy when we think. So if you're thinking a lot or overthinking, overanalyzing things in your life, of course that's going to leave you feeling drained by the end of the day. So knowing that we need to work around this because it will be difficult to build momentum when you're coming from a place where you feel like you just don't even have the energy to start making things better for yourself. So the two tips I wanna share with you in this video are one, you need to start taking small steps towards making your life better. And two, you need to figure out what the hell you want your life to look like in the future in the first place. So the first thing, you need to take small steps and they have to be small because remember how we were talking about how you probably are feeling a bit drained right now? How the hell are you going to make things better if you try taking medium or even big steps towards making your life better? You're probably not going to succeed in that endeavor because you're not going to have the energy necessary to take those larger steps. So start small. That's how you build momentum. You can't Expect to build momentum if you're trying to do the most daunting thing first. So if you want to make your life better because maybe your job isn't great, then spend five to 10 minutes a day looking for new jobs. Maybe fill out one to two applications a day. That's something that you can actually do every day for a few weeks because it's not super taxing on you mentally and energetically. It's a small step. You can even just do one job application a day. And that's far better than trying to do 20 or more per day, which is very unsustainable, especially because you'll start losing motivation if you don't hear back immediately. You'll feel like your effort is meaningless in that regard. And another example would be maybe you're not feeling great because you want to lose weight or something like that. Well, then you can spend five to 10 minutes each day exercising. That's not a whole lot of time. That's something anyone can sign up for no matter how busy they are. That could literally just be jogging in place or doing squats or doing push-ups, whatever it may be. Five to 10 minutes isn't much and that's something anyone can do. It's a lot different than immediately signing up for a gym membership and starting to do an hour workout every single day. So start small. That's how you build momentum. Don't expect to start getting the ball rolling if you're trying to immediately push the biggest boulder you can find instead of some small rock. Start small. Now, the next thing, it's important that you figure out where you wanna be in life. So start asking yourself, where do you see yourself six months from now, a year from now, or five years from now? Plan your future, because that will give you something to work towards. If you're not feeling great, if you're feeling like your life isn't what you desire right now, then you need to have a roadmap to get you where you want to be. You need to know where you want to be. That's very important because otherwise you're gonna stay where you are for quite some time. You're gonna stay in that pit. You're gonna stay feeling stuck and unhappy. So think about what you want your life to look like. I would actually say you should spend yet again, five to 10 minutes each day, literally asking yourself those questions. Where do I wanna be? six months from now, where do I want to be one year from now, five years, and go on from there. You need to think about that because then you can start taking small steps towards creating the future that you envision for yourself. And that is very powerful. That will help you build a lot of momentum over time and get out of the pit that you may feel like you're currently in. Now, I'm making this video because these are all things that I'm doing myself to help myself get out of the, I'm not really in a pit per se, but just 
life isn't quite the way I want it to be right now, so I'm working towards making it better. And by the way, I'm not saying this for any pity, so don't give me any. I mean, I'm handling my shit on my own. I don't need the pity from anyone. I'm just sharing it with you because I know that these things work. So put them into practice in your own life as well, and you'll see how powerful they are. They literally help you build that motivation, that momentum, that can't be stopped. And the more that you do those small steps, the more they kind of snowball over time. And then you'll have the energy to start taking the medium to larger steps over time. But you have to start small just so that you can start building that momentum, start accomplishing small tasks every single day. And you'll feel better for that. You'll know that you're actually doing something. You're making progress. And with progress, momentum comes so naturally. But anyway, I hope this video helped you and I'll see you guys in the next one. Arrivederci!